Black Friday, you know, uh, let me tell you about that. I got six big three wick candles from Bath and Body Works. Only 50 bucks. Cyber Monday, a subscription to Hulu, two bucks a month for the next year. I was killing it. And I'm sure a lot of you got deals even bigger and better. But today, it's not about what you got. It's about what you can give. It's Giving Tuesday, and the United Way has a great story to share. All too often, this time of year is consumed with everyone looking for the bargains of Black Friday and Cyber Monday. Deals to enhance their own worldly possessions. But what about Giving Tuesday, a day designed for people to help others and not themselves? The one currency that everyone has um, and deep reserve is generosity. It can be a powerful force to really unite people and our communities. Um, we've seen it time and time again, and it's a really special day. Giving Tuesday was created in 2012, and it has added significance on this, the 10-year anniversary. The Perot Foundation is gifting the United Way of Metropolitan Dallas $15 million, the largest single investment it's ever received in its 98-year history. And now it allows the organization to attack their three main areas of focus, unlike ever before. Education, income, and health across North Texas. So it's not only significant for the size of the commitment, but also equally important for how we're structured to leverage it. So how do you even separate those three prongs? How do you even prioritize those? We'll be strengthening connections with students, with teachers, and with mentors from an early age to increase kindergarten readiness and childhood literacy and ensuring that everyone in our community has the job skills necessary to find and maintain work that enables financial stability, that they have access to nutritional meals, primary health care insurance, and mental health services so that all North Texans can get and stay healthy and live longer and better lives. On this day of all days that should tap into all of our spirits when it comes to giving, how do you encourage others to even do that? Writing a thank you note to a local healthcare or community hero, people who do an extraordinary amount of good with their time and talents, often without recognition. It could mean calling your parents or your grandparents and saying, I love you and thank you. It really is. Giving Tuesday has become a holiday season force for good. And it is a compelling reminder that there is so much more that unites us than divides us. That is so true. The Perot family has supported the United Way of Metropolitan Dallas for the past 50 years. And you saw Cowboys Hall of Fame quarterback Troy Aikman in the story. He's raised millions of dollars for the organization as well. How wonderful and what a wonderful reminder of really what everything is all about this time of year. There is no unified way to give. There is many ways we can all give and it does not have to be money. Yeah, and every every little bit go counts, yes, you know, it does. even if it's volunteer hours that we're talking about.